Hello, and thanks for joining me here. Today, I wanna to talk to you about four core concepts in becoming fit, fab, and fearless, how to regain control of your life. Um, I've been talking with you some time about these, and some of you wanna you want to know a little bit more. You like think you need something, but you're not sure what it is. And there's four core concepts that have really helped my clients become fit, fab, and fearless. And one of those is deciding first and foremost and accepting personal responsibility that you want to create some change. Now, here's the thing. A lot of people kind of know that and they know that they're in the driver's seat, but they haven't taken that seat yet. They're, they're still not in control. They're not able to make themselves be the driver. And so that's one of the things that I really enjoy help people doing is learn how to actually make decisions for themselves to actually gain and regain control when it comes to all areas of life, fitness, food, family, career, okay? Because a lot of times we know what we should do and we keep telling ourselves we need to do things, but we have a hard time fully being in control and fully the ability to make those decisions. And when you can make those decisions, a huge weight is lifted off of you in so many ways. You've regained control of your life. And so that's the first one, deciding and putting you in the driver's seat, okay? So secondly is boundaries. You know, a lot of us, you know, we, we're caring people, we wanna help people. But because we let so many people in and we haven't created boundaries in our personal life, and that could be in our family, that could be with friends or in our career, when we have those unclear boundaries, other people can suck the energy out of us. We can feel overwhelmed and suddenly we're letting all this outside stuff take over and we start to question what we're doing. We start to question how we truly feel. And so when I help you uncover how you truly feel and give you the ability to start to take action on what you truly want to do, you'll be able to create these positive boundaries in your life that allow you to do more and be more. Because again, a lot of times we think we know what to do, but we're not doing those. And so we need to be empowered to actually make those decisions and put those things in place to be successful, okay? And so if this is making sense to you, please give this a like or a comment and let me know because a lot of people are kind of in this, this wheel turning where we kind of know, but we're not taking action. And even imperfect action is better than no action. And that's how we move forward. And that's what I'm looking to help some women fully do for themselves, to be in control. Okay, so again, maybe you know it, but you're just not there yet. And then, I'm gonna get this off my screen, there we go. And then reframe, that's my third, my third little core concept, reframe. Um, you know, sometimes it's hard for us to take negative or difficult situations, but if we learn how to reframe them into positives, turn them into lessons and actually use them, embrace those struggles, they don't pull us down anymore. I know I spent a lot of my years of my life feeling pulled down. And when I was then in control, I was able to start to rewrite my story. And the same for some of my really successful clients that I've worked with on a one-on-one -on -one basis. They've been able to write their story, what they want to happen, how it's gonna end, instead of letting outside factors influence it and steer them a direction they didn't want to go. They, they did because someone else pulled them there. So I want to help you write your actual story, okay? And I'll, and I'll tell you how we can do that at the end because it's really empowering when you know who you are, you've gained control, you're doing the things that you want to do, you're in the driver's seat, and you're the author of your own story because you absolutely can be everything you want to be. That vision you have in your head 
It's going to stay a dream or a vision if you don't ever take action on it. And we need support. We need help to help us put things into action. Okay? You know, we don't just want to want to think about it. And then focusing back on the unhealthy. That's my fourth little core concept. I think sometimes we get swayed a bit away by social media, by things we see, kind of telling us that in order to be healthy or in order to be happy, you need to look a certain way, right? And so suddenly the ability to be fit and strong and confident in a healthy way is turned another direction because now we're focusing on maybe, oh my gosh, well now I'm not good enough because you know I see all these pictures of the time of people with flat abs or with six packs or shapely arms or legs or whatever it is. And for women especially, that becomes some subtle brainwashing that we beat ourselves down. And so maybe you've been there before too, where you keep trying to strive for this one thing and you think that if you have abs and if you think if you lose weight, then you're gonna really be happy. But a lot of times that doesn't happen. And I can tell you that from experience. If you recall way back, I won a national fitness championship. I was in magazines. I had the six pack. I had, you know, everything, the awards, the trophies, all the other stuff that went along with it. But I still beat myself up about not being good enough. So what I'm trying to tell you is think about what truly is going to make you happy and health is important at the end of the day. And so creating these things that I've talked about here between deciding and actually being in the driver's seat, setting some boundaries, writing your own personal story, and focusing on health. What's really cool is if you can kind of flip the mindset on that and re reframe it a little bit, those other things are gonna come, they're gonna happen, because you're not focusing on it so hard. Sounds pretty crazy, doesn't it? You're going to enjoy things. You're going to want to do things, okay? And you're going to want to do them for you. You're going to truly live in a fit, strong, confident body when you learn how to fully expand on those core concepts, okay? And so again, that's in my program, Fit, Fab, Fearless Mentorship. That's what I'll help you discover on a one-on-one -on -one basis and how to actually put those into play. For women who are really ready to take even imperfect action and make those steps and fully regain control of their life. Because when you are fully in control, you are going to be healthy. You are going to be happy. You're going to put a real smile on your face. You're going to do it all and be it all. Life isn't going to pull you down. And when those speed bumps come, because they are going to come, that's life. You're going to be able to handle them full force. It's not going to drag you down into that dark hole. But you need to be equipped with some certain strategies. And that's what I want to help you do. And so my Fit, Fab, and Fearless mentorship program is something that has been 20 years in the works, mainly in the past five years, and super solid in the past two years. You're going to get my best, best strategies from trial and error, from working with the top coaches, the top counselors, and working with other clients who have achieved an extremely high level of success. Because you might forget, I've worked with individuals who have taken their career to the next level athletically, being three-time history-making champions, to women that lost 40, 50, 60, and even 70 pounds and truly can carry all the weight of the world on their shoulders and feel good about themselves, that all came from working with me in a one-on-one -on -one setting. And I have not taken on any private clients in two years because, quite honestly, I can't always give that level of support to everyone. And that's why this program also is not a fit for everyone. But if this is you and you want to finally regain control 
This is a limited opportunity because I'm interviewing some women right now who are motivated and committed to regaining control of their life. And I'll put the link, the application link in the comments, but this is a limited time opportunity. This is the first time in two years I'm opening up to work with some individuals one-on-one. -on -one. Now I wanna be clear, fitness and nutrition sure is a part of it, but that's not the focus. The fit, fab, and the fearless, those core concepts, working with those so that you, you can actually be in your driver's seat and actually write your own story, that's going to make, be the main thing, to empower you to be in control. That's right, to stand tall, okay? So looking awesome, you know, that, that's going to be a bonus that comes along with it. And so if this is you, um, I'm going to start working with a small group of women. I'm only taking on five women, and I am down to three spots only. We're going to start working together on or before March 20th. So if this is something you're thinking about, well, if you procrastinate, you might miss out on an opportunity. So if you're ready to move forward, I'll put the link in the comments, okay? You can fill out the application. I'll review your application, and if it makes sense for us to get on the phone and talk about how we might be able to work together, that's what'll happen next. And then on that phone call, we'll decide if it makes sense, if there's an opportunity for you to work with me, okay? So again, don't think about it too long because this opportunity is gonna slip you by and I'm ready to get started with some awesome ladies to take them to the next level. And again, before March 20th, I'm already down to three spots, that's it. And who knows when this opportunity will be here for you again to fully embrace being fit, fab, and fearless. So I hope you'll join me or share this video with someone who might, might be a fit for this program. And heck, guys, if you love your spouse or significant other and you know she's awesome and you think she needs to, you know, or she's expressed that something's just not sitting well and she can't figure it out what it is, encourage her to apply. Because we all need super support systems, but I'll tell you what, those of us that think we're gonna figure it out on our own, that's one of the biggest mistakes. Because I can tell you I've invested the past five years fixing what was broken. You can't do it alone. But what I can tell you is, from all of this, in a, in a shorter term program, wow, you can make some uh, success. I'll help you stop the, the hamster wheel and actually move up the ladder of feeling good, being fit, being strong, being confident. So again, if you're serious about being a fit, fab, and fearless woman, I'll post the link in the comments, fill out the application, and we'll go from there. I hope you're having a great day. Watch the video back at the beginning if you're just catching it now, if you wanna learn more about those core concepts, and maybe you can try applying a couple things now to keep you moving forward. Because remember, even imperfect action is better than no action at all. So have a great day.